we are at the base of the Black Mountain grade almost and we're on track to arrive at the supercharger in East Asheville with 35% state of charge. We'll see how we actually do going up the mountain. It's a pretty steep grade. Okay, just got off uh, the 240 bypass around Asheville, and we're just waiting at a stoplight to go over to the Whole Foods Shopping Center and charge up at the new supercharger. Well, that was a very confusing intersection, and so I got going the wrong way, and we're about to pull a U-turn here. Interestingly enough, it uh, hasn't been saying it's preconditioning the battery, so it must be at a good temperature to charge. One more thing. Uh, it's estimating that if we wanted to go back to the trailhead without charging here, we could still do it, and we would end up at the trailhead with 12% state of charge. Let's look at the energy usage for this trip. Uh, it was originally estimating we'd get here at 36%. Now it's estimating we'll get here at 34%, and we're almost there. We made it. We are at the Whole Foods, and there's no supercharger here. <laughs> That's weird. There's one here, but it won't reach. So I guess I need to move. Okay, let's try this again. Just went sideways there, and then a whole row. So we'll take this one, point it, press the button, plug it in. These are all supposed to be new V3 superchargers, so let's see how we're doing. Says we're supercharging, says we'll be at our limit in 35 minutes. I think I set the limit at around 90, so we may leave before then, especially once the charge starts to taper. But right now, we're getting really good charge rate. Look at that. Shot right up to 207 for a second. And now it's a little backing off a little bit. It's 190 something. All right. So I reset the charge limit from 90 something to around 80 and that brought the time to charge down uh, to about 25 minutes. I walked over to Whole Foods and picked up some cranberry juice and now we're, we're already up at 63%. The, the charge rate has dropped down to 85 kilowatts. So we'll see. If it tapers any more below 50, I might go ahead and go because I think I've got enough to get back to Hendersonville, pick up my wife, and get back to Charlotte tonight.